Let's turn to the weather now. Nice weather for voters today. Here is a live look above the city. Over downtown, temperatures rising into the 50s in some areas. Meteorologist Mary Kay Kleist here now tracking some rain, though, on the way for later tonight. Hi, Mary Kay. Hello, Joe and Erica. Yes, there are two systems I'm tracking. One, as you mentioned, making us wet tonight. The second one, a little more interesting for Friday. It is a winter storm. Depending on the storm track, right now it looks like we will start Friday with morning downpours, switch it to an icy mix in the middle of the day, and maybe end up with shoveling late in the day. So Friday, that storm is far more interesting than the one we're dealing with tonight because I think tonight it's just going to be some overnight rain you may even miss as you sleep. 45 degrees in Chicago. It's 50 in Champaign, 47 in South Bend, Metro Detroit holding at 45 degrees. So that rain is a fast mover. Here is midnight. I think the best coverage of rain will be for a couple hours there around the midnight hour. But notice temperatures keep rising. So only rain here in Chicago with this fast mover by 630 any drizzle starts moving out and then skies start clearing by tomorrow afternoon so that's a fast one tonight we just see the clouds gathering ahead of it at the airports 44 right now at midway it is 38 degrees in waukegan but 48 for you in kankakee so the high clouds already here rain not too far away starting to sneak into the quad cities now with snow well to the west across western iowa southern minnesota so hour by hour tonight we're keeping it cloudy Temperatures will actually rise as that rain moves in. And as we hover around 40, I only expect rain for a couple of hours here in the middle of the night. So as we track this out this evening, we're OK. But by about 11 o'clock, some light rain may start. Best coverage, though, midnight to 2 a.m. Everything pushes eastward for us. And then we start with clouds early tomorrow, hoping for some peaks of sun as temperatures will rise about 15 degrees above the average. So our forecast tonight calls for rain to develop. We hit 38 late this evening and then those temperatures rise. Tomorrow we'll see 56 and a front comes through tomorrow evening, cooling us down to 40 on Thursday. But Friday, that's what we're watching and it all depends on that storm track. As low pressure starts setting up over St. Louis Friday morning, the moisture source ahead of it is deep from the Gulf of Mexico. That all moves into Chicago to start as rain. If this storm stays on track targeting Indianapolis, that would set up a mix for us in the middle of the day and perhaps that snow accumulation on the back side. It's a little too soon to put numbers on it, but when we look at the two different models we like to look at, this is the European. That shows the heaviest snow from, say, Cedar Rapids to Green Bay, north of us. But the American model lays it out more so over Chicago into the Detroit area. So what we know is that it will probably start as rain and then change it over to snow. So I think Friday, both rush hours will be a mess, but luckily it's just one day, Joe and Erica, because because then by the weekend, we start clearing out. Sunday's looking nice, 43 with some sunshine. All right, thanks, Mary Kay.